Hi everyone, this is Sumit here and welcome to my channel Excel with Sumit. In this video, I'll explain how to create attendance tracker within Excel. For example, here you see you have employee ID and you have days of the month and here I have created how many days the employees were present in the particular month. So here I'll explain how you can do quickly in Excel. To start with, suppose you have a column employee ID where you have all set of employees in the rows and then in the columns you have the days of the month. So now here I'll explain how to get a checkbox. So in the recent Excel, you have got this feature within the insert tab. So when you click the insert tab, you see that you have got an option called checkbox. So to include this within the cells, first you need to select the cells and then you need to go to insert here again and then click here checkbox. As soon as you click this, you see that you have got the checkbox within Excel. Now suppose if you click any of the boxes, you will not get any output for the cells. So to get the output in the cells, you have to write a formula. To do that, you'll go to the cell where you need to write the formula. Press equal to write formula count if C O U N T. Then you click the down arrow and go to count if and then press tab. Now you have to select the rows for first employee for entire month. So using the keyboard, I'll select each day of the first employee. So I'll select the first cell and then I'll drag this towards the first day of the month. I'll press comma. And then here I will write true T R U E and then I'll press enter. We see that we have got the value three because you have selected three checkboxes here for the first employee. Now, if you drag the formula towards the bottom, you see that you have got the value zero because you're not checked for any of the employee here. Now, suppose if you mark attendance for any of the employees, suppose we do for the employee number 216 here, or if you do here, or if you do here, we see that the count increased. Now, if you randomly click check boxes, for many of the employees, we see that the count will be added for the respective employee and for the respective month. Now, in this way, you can get the checkbox created in Excel and then you can complete the attendance tracker. Now, suppose if you want to replicate this for the another month, you need to select all the cells here and then press delete button. Immediately here, all the checkboxes which were checked here will become unchecked and then you'll get the count to zero. In this fashion, you can create checkbox in the Excel which can help you to create attendance tracker very quickly and efficiently.